I'm about as real as they come. All my beats tailored by Joe. Maserati Rick in Detroit Convertible bird in Miami Graduated summa cum laude Strip club made a tsunami Carlton Hines with the ball game Grateful Edmonds with the snowflakes Craig Pettis in the M-Town Sal Magluta with the boat game Falcone with the cocaine Like Freeway Ricky with the plug game Like Monster Cody in South Central Larry Davis from Close Range The Rod of 12 in Kansas City so strong Cause we had love and unity for each other you know what I'm saying? From all the way from you kid 39th Street, 25th Street, Vine, and nothing else. But couldn't nobody come down on 12 because we had the unity that was done 12. The projects out here. This is this is where it is. Parker we're, Square, Charlie Parker, TV Walkers, Ray Park, shit on uh, Wayne Minor, 12th Street. The whole block is all this is all right in here. Tell these niggas where you from, man. 12. You know where you at? For sure, man. What city is this? Kansas City, Mother. KC, Missouri, 12th Street, 1200. For the sure, real man. mob right here. 1200, man. 1200. For sure, man. This is where I'm from, man. Hell yeah, Keep man. Keep it real. You know, some players that got me and Demi, but they got right back. You know what I'm saying? Right there, real. man. I got shot. I'm just on a late night chilling. 14 yeah, years man. old, but this is real out here. Live, right? Kansas City woman once on the FBI's most wanted list may be going back to prison. Police arrested Shante Henderson yesterday after she ran from officers. She was a passenger in a car that police tried pulling over. Once the car stopped, officers say she threw a handgun and a bag of marijuana. She tried to get away. Since Henderson is a convicted felon, she could face federal charges. A verdict is expected tonight in the murder trial of a Kansas City woman who was once on the FBI's most wanted list. 26-year-old Shante Henderson admits she shot and killed Deandra Parker, but she says it was self-defense. KMBC 9's Peggy Bright is live with what the judge thinks. Peggy? Well, Larry, and it just came down only moments ago. The judge said not guilty of second-degree murder, but guilty of voluntary manslaughter and guilty of armed criminal action. Shante Henderson said it was him or her. I was scared I was going to lose my life. Shante Henderson says she was afraid of 20-year-old DeAndre Parker back on September 2, 2006. They ran into each other at a South Kansas City gas station that afternoon. He was walking out. She was heading in. I glanced and at the same time he's looking up. I saw him immediately like in a deep stare, like I'm staring at you right now. We know something's going on. Parker's girlfriend says suddenly Shante Henderson pulled a 40 caliber gun and began firing. Then the girlfriend says Parker tried to drive away. His attempt was too late by the time he realized that he made a choice whether he was going to attempt to try to save me or move the car. And he saved me versus moving the car. Henderson testified it happened the other way around, that Parker started driving at her, then she grabbed her gun. So when I jump backwards, I'm like cornered with an ice machine and just like a corner. So as I jump back and get in that corner, turns the wheel, come towards me again, which gave me no choice but to pull out my gun and start shooting. Now this was a, a one-day trial. It was held only in front of the judge. And he just issued his ruling just moments ago, so we're going to be trying to get some reaction from relatives and bring that to you tonight on our news at 6. We're live at the Jackson County Courthouse. Back to you, Larry. Peggy Bright, thank you very much. When Henderson was placed on the FBI's most wanted list, authorities said she was a person of interest in five other murders and a suspect in a dozen other shows. Police say she's at the heart of the recent wave of gang violence. Shante Henderson. Shante Henderson. One of America's most wanted. Most wanted people in the and could be responsible for the shooting to 40 people. She's charged with one charge. And they have had a hand. They have had a hand. Police say as soon as they got the tip, they put their wheels in motion. They're lighting up the tip hotline. Police say suspected gang leader Sean Davis. The woman for the body count increases. Who is? Who is? Sean Davis. Sean Davis. Yo, yo. We back. It's your boy Popola. Mob Ties. We in a black Jeep headed on the way to the Midwest. St. Louis Mo. All my niggas from St. Louis, y'all niggas get in the comment box. We don't get around here often, but I can tell us some gangster shit going on. Matter of fact, meet us at Charlie Parker Square. 
We about to thug. Now, the individual we're going to be covering today is going to be Shante Henderson. And let me say that again. It's going to be Shante Henderson. Because I know we rarely get to cover females. But when you get a female like this, it's almost hard not to cover it's almost with like a, a number of set 10 people when I first started this like yeah I need to definitely speak on this person I need to speak on this person and I'm not going to go into details but she was definitely one of them and the reason well, was multiple reasons why but one of the main reasons why is she was a wanted fugitive that was apprehended on March 31st 2007 by the FBI after being listed on their top 10 most wanted fugitive list now it was a reward for a hundred thousand for information leading to her arrest at that time now if that's not enough to get you on mob ties i really don't have no idea what's gonna put you on this bitch to be honest but yeah uh, it was a lot of like media coverage surrounding her. It was only a handful of women pretty much that have been on the FBI most wanted list. And a lot of times they were on there for terroristic type shit. It wasn't no, and I guess you would, to some, to some people they would consider what she did pretty much terroristic because some media outlets kind of attribute her to upwards of 50 shootings some media outlets attribute her to being the leader of the notorious 12th street gang that also had an affiliation with the 51st street gang so it's just it's just real deep now according to newsweek henderson grew up in charlie parker square housing projects in kansas kansas city and she pretty much had a turbulent life her mother reportedly died when she was young. Her father abandoned her. She turned to the 12th Street Gang and the 51st Street Affiliate at an early age. Authorities say she modeled herself after a notorious gangster in St. Louis by the name of Steve Wright. And they are gonna say he's a vicious 51st Street Gang member who is now serving federal time. Anybody that know anything about Mr. Steve Wright, y'all get in the comment box, his reputation, what he in a, what he in a lamb for now. With her ruthlessness and her purchase for high powered weaponry like assault rifles with a hundred bullet clips, she also became feared in the streets. And when we say she's feared in the streets, authorities suspect her or suspected her and upwards of five homicides even though she wasn't charged with any and like i said it's multiple media outlets that accuse her for upwards to 40 or 50 shootings and the news outlets are going to say around 12 and 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 that's just uh they rounding it out they throwing it out so let's just say anywhere from a, over a dozen to 50 uh, i'm gonna attribute her with 35 is that a, is that a good number yeah so that the shit is wicked but she made national headlines when she was named to the fbi's top 10 most wanted list and the reason that she was named there because she was a fugitive for a homicide that happened on september the 12th 2006 when Henderson, when according to authorities, Henderson shot and killed DeAndre Parker at a gas station in Kansas City, Missouri. Now, I, well, I say according to authorities, she admit to shooting DeAndre Parker. It's just the circumstances surrounding that shooting is what varied. Now, Henderson claimed that Parker was trying to run her over with his truck. A jury acquitted Henderson of murder charges, but found her guilty of a lesser charge of voluntary manslaughter and armed criminal action now the kansas city police department claimed that henderson was the leader of the violent 12th street gang that i spoke about earlier and they also had affiliations with not only the 51st street they also had affiliations with 24th street 27th street and 57th street so their allegiance was titled 512 or 582 
or five eighths deuce. However, it claims that with the police pretty much claimed that she was the head and involved with multiple shootings that the gang like led and was suspected in. So in May 2012, well, even before we get to that, on October the 27th, 2011, Henderson pleaded guilty to felony, to felonious possession of a firearm. Now, in April of 2012, Henderson was sentenced to seven years in federal prison without parole. Now, on May 2012, on top of that seven, Henderson was sentenced to serve 10 years in prison for the 2006 manslaughter conviction for which she had previously been sentenced to on probation. So after killing DeAndre Parker, she was sentenced to probation. And that's where we're going to get where she sped off for the cops. They're going to say she tossed the weapon out the vehicle as well as the marijuana. So uh, I'm, I'm just going to say like when you when you like that in the community or when you suspected of such acts in the community, police and authority and law enforcement is going to do everything they can to put the full out press to get that ball out your hand. And it sounds like uh, she was just in that thug mentality for real, for real. Cause anytime they say you're involved with that amount of shootings as a female, even if it was a male, we'd be, like looking at it but so i don't know what to say kansas city y'all on some shit and we'll be back soon y'all make sure y'all follow me on instagram on twitter it's your boy pop a lot p-o-p underscore a underscore l-o-t we gonna be back with some more real trill spill shit and y'all know what it is mr mob 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 ties <laughs>